Hey guys, welcome to video number two on my How to Speedrun No Time to Explain Remastered. Uh, in this video, I will end the next couple of videos. I will uh, go over how to speedrun each specific world um, and just a few tips and tricks in each of them. Uh, I will not be going over any of the 100% uh, stuff, like getting hats and stuff. Uh, but just for the end of send route, um, I will make hat videos down the line for 100%, but, but for now, we'll just uh, take a look at each individual level. Starting off with level number one. Uh, so as soon as you spawn in, you just want to mash escape. So skip cutscene, obviously, and you can see here how, like... If you notice that the uh, the name above the character uh, that's up here actually spawns in or shows while the screen is still black, you can actually move during that uh, black screen. So just hold right uh, after the cutscene is ending. Uh, so let's try and, and restart the level and see how that works. We uh, nice escape. Hold right. And you can see during the black screen, the uh, the name actually moves. Uh, and you can do that for uh, a lot of other uh, cutscene skips. Um, oh, now I actually exited it. I didn't want to do that. Right off the bat, you just hold right. And as soon as the uh, character lands, you start shooting to the left. Or shooting yourself to the left. Try to hit... This slope, actually, get the slope around here if you can. Uh, so something like this, maybe shoot a little bit down to get some extra height as soon as you hit. If you don't do that, it can just not get you over the next hill. So do something like that. Try to get under this thing and just go into the portal. The first few levels aren't that hard, but it can be nice. Again, as soon as you, uh, you spawn in, Start moving. This one is very similar. Hit the first hill, go over, and into the portal. Um, my ribs are in my eyes. For this one, you just go over. There's the, not much to it. You don't obviously don't land in there. Avoid this uh, bike down again, uh, and go into the portal. I really, uh, I'm really looking forward to getting to like <laughs> the spaceship levels to not hear this guy scream every time I restart a level. Um, for Russia, uh, you can actually do something really cool because you spawn up here, can uh, shoot right away to to get up to to the top of the uh, get up to the top of the hill here, um, which definitely saves some some time. Like that. Um, you can't just you can't just hold down uh, uh, the laser as I did there, because then you, you don't get the uh, the jump. So you have to time it a little bit uh, perfectly. There's a little uh, what to call it, a little bit of time where you can actually jump from your spawn uh, in midair and land up here. Um, it's a little hard to get used to and, and, and get the timing right, but once you get it, it's it's not too bad. And even if you miss it, you just land down here so you can just complete the, the level as normal. Uh, up here, you want to uh, shoot down, shoot downwards to slower your descent uh, once you get down uh, below these spikes. Because if you don't, you just like, you get knocked down. Um, can we get up here? Yeah, we can. Good. Um, <clears throat> you never have to get that way normally so uh so instead just like oh that's that's not what i wanted just do like that uh a short little tap will to, to slow your descent doesn't have to be much i think you can actually whoops um you can even do no you can't okay sometimes you can shoot yourself further or faster downwards um but yeah, here you just one tap, go under, and into the portal. Very easy. And now for the first boss. Um, 
For this one, you want to stand around here. But as soon as you get over the hill, you just start shooting. Uh, shoot diagonal here, so you have... Um, you hit the thrusters the entire time. Uh, and once the first... I uh, oh, can't see my uh, cursor. Uh, once the first thruster blows out, you start moving uh, oh, moving with the uh, the thrusters around because you can't have the continuous stream of damage. Um, if you can, you want to try to focus your fire on the one opposite the one you just blew out to uh, uh, make sure the ship is stabilized. If you blow out two next to one two next to each other. Uh, the, the ship will start to wobble, uh, making it harder to actually get damage in on the uh, the last two um, from your position. Uh, so so yeah, that's what you uh, want to do. So let's try and, uh, and restart and uh, see how we do here. You shoot up to the left there at the beginning because the screen needs to pan before you can actually get damage over here. Now we focus on that one. Ah, so close. Uh, not really, but that was uh, that was pretty decent. Once the ship fall down, I like to uh, just start hovering here, just holding left mouse button. As soon as the ship like dips below the horizon, you can start jumping. Because if you are on the right side of the uh, the crap here, um, there's just a safe spot where it can't hurt you at all. And uh, you just keep on shooting down. Uh, and as soon as the uh, last damage takes here, you press escape, click select level, and you exit out to uh, skip an otherwise unskippable cutscene. Um, and yeah, that was level one of No Time to Explain, remastered, and see you in the next video.